Hogwarts Prime Reviews, going hard panther. Here comes the latest review by Hogwarts Prime. Good day everyone, this is John Bart, Hogwarts Prime Reviews. As always, great to see you and wishing you all the very best. I hope I'm glad you've come back. Please feel free to like, share, and subscribe if you like and enjoy the content I provide, which I thoroughly hope you do. Please leave comments below. And it costs nothing but means the world if you know you can support the channel by liking and subscribing if you enjoy it. And also feel free to click that notification bell for latest content. Just let me move my camera around. I've got a new table and I'm just setting everything up properly. So notification bell so here we go today we have another micro master review which i'm fully excited i've had this for about a month but i've just had so many things to do i haven't had a chance to do it it is again off the amazing chris mead christopher mead on facebook and a member of hodmas prime reviews feel free to check him out at cem toys as well he got me these top bloke really cheap too this time it is Autobot, Top Shot, and Flak, the Battle Patrol. This is the S, Wolf for Cybertron, S6, Takara, Terry, Generations, Transformers, Wolf for Cybertron, Trilogy, AG, Daddy, Daddy 8, plus Hasbro, some barcode, says two contains two figures and instructions, MicroMaster, and as you can see, it's the only one that makes a pretty sweet gun, I'd say. I would actually say it's the only one that actually looks freaking sweet as a gun. But yeah, let's see, let's see actually, let's see, I mean I don't normally do these, I wasn't going to show you the gun mode, but let's just see, let's put them together first, let's put them together, let's put them together. So basically he just does that, flips into that, that goes there, that's flak, top shot, sounds like I'm saying top shot. <laughs> But uh, focus here, clunk click every trip. Is that right? No. Oh, hang on. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. I'm hard pampering people. I've seen what I did. Turn the waist around. That was it. Click that there. Ah, yes, I see it now. Then they lock into place there as you see that goes there now it should fit better <laughs> so that's a messed up cannon I do happen to have some blast effects to hand and I have my Netflix Bumblebee. And you can put him on there and give him an old shoulder bashing bang 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 and bang bang. Ow, I just punched my new table. It's solid pint. That was not a good idea. So yeah, it's pretty sweet gun mode. Probably not the best for this little guy. I mean, can he hold it? Yes, he can. So yeah, please feel free to check out the review of Bumblebee. But I digress. So, now he's basically transformed. Let's get him back to his vehicle mode so I can show you how to transform little old Flak here. So, as you can see, he's like some sort of like armored missile launcher nice lush green with a nice sandy yellow you've got the details there would have been nice with a little splash of paint but you know for mike master i'm just glad it's got wheels visible robot syndrome is hidden does have some rocket launchers there like you've just seen you can put blast effects on a 
and you can go stir crazy blasting it away so let's do him with stake out in vehicle mode for comparison put that back over there haven't I? Ah. hooray for packet move it over there so as you can see that's flak with stake out feel free to check out the stake out review and we're going to go on to his partner in his pack top shot which I'm just trying to transform quickly out of camera because as you just know I put it into that weird gun mode and it is yeah so right so here we go top shot again got some blast effects to hand it does work he goes pew pew bang 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 and skadoosh skadoosh and he shoots them off into the sky as you can see in this mode he's like an armored tank gun turret anti-aircraft he has a rotating turret with a nice autobot symbol oh, on the other thing i didn't mention uh flak has a nice autobot symbol they're just a little bit hidden There you go, just focus. A little bit hidden there. And again, nice Autobot insignia there. So, yep, he has nice wheels that do roll. So there's flak, they both roll. And basically, top shot is just a retool of Red Heat. So please feel free to check out my review of him. And yeah pretty freaking sweet so i'm going to transform i'll start with top shot seems he's in hand first of all you want to rotate the turret like that so it's backwards out of the way then first start by rotating the leg downwards again flick it downwards flick that back flick that back it becomes a heel spur then you're basically transformed pull the arms down turn his gun turret around and yeah there's top shot as you can see he's got a nice blue face and he does, as you can see, his head rotates, which is a nice little feature. I wish all of them could do that. So there is top, top Shot, and I think this is Bomb Shock. Please check out my Ground and Bomb Shock review. And if you haven't already, and that's how they scale. So let's go on to Flak. Excuse the dogs, the next door neighbours, it's like Batsy Dogs Home again. Every time I record, they seem to come out. So you rotate the legs backwards, straighten them. This guy's pretty easy to transform. Flick that back, and now up comes that. There's a little nodule there. Just flick it forward. And then, out of the two, this guy, out of most of my MicroMasters, I have to say Flak's one of my favourite. It just looks like he's such a gung-ho guy. And it's just a lovely, fun to articulate. I've had loads of ages playing time playing with this little figure. I mean, look there, you've got the nice detail. Try and get it to zoom in. There you go, the nice detail on the yellow goggles on the face. Looks freaking sweet. That detail on the abdomen is nice, flush red. And you've got the nice three fingers, like hot rod type guns on the hands. So, pretty awesome. That articulation, his leg goes all the way back there. His leg goes all the way forwards. He can do the full Van Damme. Head rotation is, he can flip back. And it goes forward, so that's your transformation. His arm can go there, all the way up, and all the way out. And there is no waist rotation. So we'll do a comparison this time with, just hit my camera, Growl. Another one of my favourites from one of my other reviews. Feel free to check it out. But he can never stand up straight because his backpack's too heavy. But there you go, that's the thing on there. And I forgot to say on this guy, his head rotates and his arms go all the way around. His leg goes forward. His leg goes back that far. If you move the turret out of the way, you can get a bit further back. And he can do the full Van Damme. And he does have waist rotation. So yeah, pretty freaking sweet figures. I'm really happy with them. So thank you, Chris Mead. Uh, please join me back in the studio for my final thoughts. I hope you will. Yeah. And welcome back. So let's go for the final thoughts of these amazing little guys. As I said, this guy is just a retool of 
red heat but it's good i do like the head rotation is a nice little trick and i do like the way the setup as you can see you know they work with blast effect nice little figures i've always thought these micromasters are amazing the originals when i was a kid i used to love them I used to just put them in pocket good to me nans god rest us all used to go to hers sit there play for hours with them it was one of them things as a kid you could just put your micromasters in your pocket and have hours of fun with an amazing toy and these do not disappoint uh, amazing little figures as you can see i have got quite a few of them in my uh, playlist please feel free to check them out on the earth rise and the siege play playlist the micromasters uh, yeah i definitely recommend you check check them out uh chris me christopher mead is who i got these bad boys off he's a good lad and a good friend to the channel and a good friend to myself so he's a top lad he will not steer you wrong chris mead as i say at cem toys feel free to check him out so this has been the john bot i must prime reviews reviewing the autobot top shot and flak siege war for cybertron trilogy micromaster two pack so till next time please take care and thanks for watching scooby-doo ending <laughs>